Thakkar from K B Agrawal English Medium School. Here we will learn. Uh, we will uh, know about blueprint of economics standard twelve. Initially, we, uh, in our board examinations are there. So we should be learn about. We should be known about blueprint. What questions will be there? What which uh, chapter should be uh, weighted very more and how to prepare in examinations so let me know about blueprint <coughs> there are five sections a b c d and e and section a contains one marks which is your mcqs section b one marks there will be one liner question section c two marks questions so we will learn about that also section d contains three marks and section e contains five marks and there are your 11 lessons so we will know how many questions will come in examination at the lesson wise okay so such a uh, chapter 1 chapter 1 has no mcqs so you do not have to wait in section uh, mcqs in sector uh, chapter 1 Then section B, there will be one question from that. Section C, two marks questions will be two questions. So be prepared for that also. Section D contains one question, and section E means in uh, for chapter one, your no questions will be of five marks question. Okay, and total there are eight marks section uh, chapter two. There are MC, uh, two MCQs. One one liner, two two marks questions, one three marks questions, and E section has no question. So overall, your chapter two is of ten marks. Chapter three, MCQs will be one. Section C, one two marks question. Section D, no questions will be there. Section E, one question. So be prepared for that also. because in examinations your chapter 3 contains five marks question so first of all students in examinations five marks questions are contain very much time consuming okay so prepare for that also chapter 4 section a contains one mark section b Two questions means that one line of questions are two. Section C one question, section D one question, section E no question. Overall eight marks chapter. Section chapter five one MCQ two one line of question one two marks question. Section D no question and section E so highlight that also. Section uh, sorry chapter six two mark two MCQs will be there one one liner question two two marks question one three marks question and no five marks question chapter seven one MCQ one one liner question no two marks question one three marks question and one will be five marks question. That's uh, chapter eight. No MCQ, no one line of question, but two marks question, three marks question, and five marks question. Each of one will come. Means that her one ka ek ek question aega her ek section mein. And ten marks ke liye chapter five, chapter six, and chapter seven, eight. They all are containing ten marks questions. Next. Said a uh, chapter nine. MCQ will be what? No one line of question. Two marks ke questions. Two section D. Three marks ka question. One and section E means ki one five marks ka question. Koi thi nahi means ki no questions will be there. And total eight marks are there. Section uh, chapter ten. One no MCQs. Section B, one question. Section C, two marks per questions. Two. Section D, one question, and section E, no questions. Chapter eleven, one MCQ, 
वन वन लाइन ऑफ क्वेश्चन टू मार्क्स क्वेश्चन कोई भी नहीं है सेक्शन डी थ्री मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एच वन एंड सेक्शन ई वन फाइव मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एंड चैप्टर नाइन इज एट मार्क्स चैप्टर टेन इज एट मार्क्स चैप्टर इलेवन इज टेन मार्क्स सो रिमेंबर स्टूडेंट्स यू हैव टू बी प्रिपेयर फॉर सेक्शन ए इज ट्वेल्व मार्क्स सो डोंट बी फॉर द विच इज नॉट कंटेनिंग मार्क्स बट हा वन अनादर थिंग इज दैट दिस ब्लू प्रिंट इज श्योर बट नॉट वेरी श्योर बिकॉज इन चैप्टर्स ऑफ सेक्शन डी और ई कैन बी एक्सचेंज इच वन सपोज चैप्टर टू दैर इज डी मार्क्स डी इज कंटेनिंग वन क्वेश्चन राइट बट हियर इट कैन बी लेस चांसेस टू बी एक्सचेंज बट वी नो दैट लेसन सेवन लेसन सेवन इज कंटेनिंग सेक्शन डी एंड ई सो इट कैन बी पॉसिबल दैट Three marks question comes in five marks question and five marks question can come in your three marks question and section E contains ten marks section B contains ten marks section C contains twenty eight marks and twenty eight marks means fourteen questions section D contains twenty seven marks means ki nine questions section E contains twenty five marks means ki five question and another thing section e, e is very time consuming so be prepare for that also and blueprint is very helpful to you to prepare in your examinations okay friends in next video we will learn about our first chapter of economics